We spend thousands of dollars on prescription drugs just to keep my son alive. Anthony is such a good brother and such a good son. He brings so much joy to everyone in his life. We could not imagine a life without Anthony. When Trump and Republicans pass the Trump tax for their billionaire and millionaire friends, they give a giant tax cut to wealthy pharmaceutical companies. They said some of that money would trickle down to families like ours to help lower drug costs. Now these pharmaceutical companies have announced over $45 billion in shareholder bonuses since the tax law was passed. The Pfizer CEO got an $8 million bonus, but we got higher drug prices. They lied to us. They said this tax cut would somehow benefit working families. Trump is looking out for his rich friends and he's leaving our kids behind. It's unacceptable. It's, it's unethical. Not just Trump. It's the entire GOP that's going along with this. It's trying to pass ACA repeal behind closed doors. It's trying to do all that stuff one-sided. I was taught that if you can't tell your mother what you're doing, you probably shouldn't be doing it. And in this case, the mother is us, the constituents. And the fact that you're going to negotiate some backroom deal to try to repeal this, you're going to try to you know, push these tax plans through without anybody looking at it and without taking into account what the CBO or what, what independent offices have to say about the budgetary impact to the country and how it's going to impact families across the country. It's BS. Instead of giving CEOs a giant tax break, we could have made it easier for families like mine to afford the medicines we need 